Hi, I'm Dakota James, the resident teaching artist at Flint Repertory Theatre. Today's Actors Technique video is about improvisation, specifically the idea of yes and. Before we delve into technique, let's give a quick definition of improv. Improv, which is short for improvisation, is a style of theater where many of the characters, situations, and furtherings of the plot are come up with on the spot from the characters' or actors' minds. Sometimes there is a framework or an outline to this type of theater, but the point is that the actors in the scene are coming up with those ideas as they come, a stream of consciousness on the fly. Now that we understand what improv is, basically, I can tell you what the rule of yes and means. Yes and means that you want to go along with the other characters or actors in your scene. You don't want to shut down any ideas or ways that you can further the plot. Now sometimes that is very difficult, especially when you're coming up with things on the fly. For instance, let's say one of your fellow actors points into the sky and says, Look! It's a flying hippo! And then you, as your character, say, No, that's not a hippo. That might be an example of shutting down someone's idea or stopping the energy in the scene. Think of how you might change this to a yes and, or agreeing to the situation and furthering the plot. Taking again the situation of the flying hippo, instead of saying, no, that's not a hippo, I might say, yes, and it's flying with mechanical wings? See, maybe I wanted there to be a robot in this scene, but my partner already put a hippo into the scene. There is a way for me to yes and, or your situation plus my situation, to create this awesome improvisational weirdness. It's also important to note that yes and does not mean that you always have to agree with the direction that your scene partners are going. For instance, if I wasn't sure that it wasn't right for our situation to go towards a hippo in the sky, I can still agree with the situation, but change its direction. For instance, look, there is a flying hippo! Instead of saying, no, there's not, I could say, it does look like a hippo from this angle, but I think it might actually be a giant elephant! You see, I'm offering a way for our scene partners to change the situation in a different way, but not completely shutting down the idea of a hippo. I hope this video helps you and your scene partners create a wonderful, cooperative scene next time you work together. From everyone at Flint Rep, stay safe, we'll see you soon, and don't forget to sign up for Summer Camps Online.